The suspect passed seven business parking lots, multiple side streets, and a few turning lanes, but didn't stop. What's good, YouTube fam? It's your girl, China Ahu Party, coming to you live. This video is titled, Woman Won't Leave X's House, Goes Away in Cuffs. X must have been putting it down. <laughs> Let's get right into this. Like, comment, subscribe. A deputy responded to a report of a woman banging on her ex-boyfriend's door. Hello? Hello? The fact that the cop got there and she is still at the door, she had no plans on leaving. <laughs> Reason why you keep knocking on that door? Okay, well, I need to come over here away from the door. See what? No? Ma'am, step away from the door. Go inside. I don't want her here. She's been asked to leave many, many times. She doesn't want to leave. I don't want to hurt. I don't want her arrested. I just want her out of here, please. And I want it noted. I want to report. You can see she's been doing this forever. I've been waiting for my glass to come in and break. She dated my son. They're not together anymore. Mm -hmm. And I don't want her on my premises. This is my home. Okay. And I don't this want her here. And this is my son. Oof. Mama just came out to explain the situation. I would be pissed if I was the mama. And this is my property. My son's ex-girlfriend is here banging on my door. I would be a little upset and the girl looks out of it. Honestly, I don't know if she's drunk, intoxicated, who knows, but she just doesn't look all the way there right now. And why is the son opening the door back up? <laughs> Mama just closed the door. You keep the door shut. If you wanna be no, you step on outside and go talk to your ex-girlfriend. Handle it or stay inside. And I don't want him coming out of here because I don't feel safe with her, with him. Okay. Ma'am, what is your name? Ma'am, what is your name? I don't want her in trouble. I just want her to understand she's not welcome okay. here. What's her first name? So she's not answer me. Sandra. Samantha. Samantha. Mm -hmm. Samantha. Are you are you hearing what she's saying? Y'all, I don't know what it is with this girl, but yeah, that is a little concerning that she's not even giving a damn about the cops standing there asking questions. I would have called the cops too, because <laughs> I would be very concerned for my life right now if I was that boyfriend. The way she's acting is not normal at all hello samantha do you have your driver's license your id with you okay this is going to last for a couple more minutes until my other deputy gets here and then she's going to have two routes See, one she's going to answer one, me or she's going to go to jail him or you're going to leave okay? oh no she's going to go to jail okay so okay, please that's not what we want Stop. just give me driver's license hey, i don't have it with me you still need to leave well then that. you need to talk to me i can understand how relationships and stuff like that can be very very volatile but this is not the way to act like it because i'm assuming you're an adult all right what is your last name Amanda, what is your last name? Samantha, if you keep Samantha. obstructing him, he is going to put you in cuffs. Just give him the information. This is mom. This is mom is really trying to get it through this girl's thick skull that she can go to jail for this and she needs to just go home. She needs to cooperate or whatever. She just wants her off the property. And also, it's kind of hard for her to get it through her son's skull to keep the door shut. <laughs> she had to yank the door shut again because he tried to open it once more. Like, if you really want to open the door that bad, go ahead and take your girl. Go talk it out. Go hash it out. Because mom is really trying to help you out right now, son. Let her do her thing, okay? You stay inside and go watch TV. Samantha, you're currently trespassing. Do you have ID on you? You don't? Or do you, are you not going to provide it? I don't have it. Okay. I'm asking. Do you are have you going to leave? in your car? Yeah. you have your registration in your car? Can you run that tag right there in the car? I'm showing about to show your registration. Are you, are you going to leave right now off this property? Is this her car right here? Yes. Okay. Is that a yes or no? Sam, I'm not going to ask you again. Sam, they're not playing with you. We just want you to leave our home. We don't wish you any ill will. You're just not welcome here anymore. You need to leave. Why would you want to go and obstruct justice and get yourself into trouble when you're being given the chance by three officers to leave here who are being very respectful and calm with you and giving you the chance to go to your home and deal with whatever it is that you need to deal with today and not be here and get yourself in trouble? It's not worth it. You just can't stay here. That's going to cause your problems later. If you get arrested, then you got to go back to court. Then you're considered a stalker. Then you're obstructions of justice, not listening to a police officer. Are you, are you going to need to leave right now? Please leave. And do not come back. Is that bad deal? Yes or no? Okay. Did she just say to court again? I, <laughs> this doesn't sound like her first rodeo. Look, at this point, if this has happened on multiple occasions, let her get charged because... <laughs> Clearly, she hasn't faced any consequences, and she feels no type of way about these cops being here. And low-key, mom sounds like a cop herself. She knows what's going to happen, <laughs> what she's going to be charged with. 
if she doesn't get off of their property, mom is doing the duty. The cops don't even have to say anything. <laughs> so you heard her. She wants you to trespass from this point. It's on camera. If you come back on this property and we catch you here, you go to jail. You understand? All right. Thank you. I don't know. I just, I just know she's young and dumb, and I just, I hate to see her mess up her future. Oh, I know. Trust me. Little, I... But she's also a little dangerous, and that worries me. All right. Like I said, if she comes back on your property, you call us. Well, she's gonna give us another reason to take her. Show Samantha twenty-seven. Go get ass. <laughs> Zooming off like that? Hell no. Get her for speeding. I know that community is like 15, 20 miles per hour. Come on now. Get her ass. Take her to jail. She seems like a spoiled brat right now. Young and dumb for sure. You're welcome. She just blew to that stop sign. Go get her. She's gonna kill somebody. Yep. The suspect passed seven business parking lots, multiple side streets, and a few turning lanes, but didn't stop. 27, 48, we're continuing 27. From the looks of it, like they said, she's either young and dumb, or maybe she is a little dangerous. <laughs> Where is she going? Like, why does she not give a damn about these cops? That's concerning. Again, look, they need to get her. They need to stop her, pull her ass over right now. <laughs> Do that Grand Theft Auto thing, you know, where they try to cut you off. Forget the car. Where is she about to take them? Where's the final destination at? Is it a trap? <laughs> We're 50 and a 50 in the slow lane. We're slowing down. We're coming up to West Virginia Street. Turn the car off! Turn it off! Turn the car off! Turn it off! Turn the car off! Turn the motherfucking car off! Did she just ask, what did I do? <laughs> Don't play victim. Don't play dumb. Unlock the door. Get on the car! What did he do? Get on the car! Oh my god, what did he do? What did he do? Give me here. What did he do? What did he do? What did he do? Don't move! What did I do? What did I do? How about run a stop sign, square your tires, and you fail to yield? Now you're in arrest. I didn't fail to yield. Yes, you did. No, I did not. Get up. The fact that she just said I didn't fail to yield, they mentioned that you flew through a stop sign. You didn't deny that one. You, what did you do? You kept going. I know you heard those sirens behind you, girl. What did you do? What did you do? Can you guys explain to me what did I do? Over here. Turn around. Can you guys explain to me? He just told you what you did. I did not fail to yield. You squealed your tires in the neighborhood. You blew the I, I squealed my tires because this and I car. Pull you over. And you didn't want to stop all the way from because Lake Mayo Shores did, and 27. Where am I supposed to stop? We are two miles away I from that. I see this entrance. That's why I stopped here, right here by nope, the entrance. No, you could have pulled in the gas station, the city hall, any street, turn lane. But I didn't understand why you guys were coming after me. Okay, that's not how that works. Can you guys yeah, you please not? Oh yes. Right. Can you guys? Please no, you're in a rush. Your car's getting towed. But what did I do? Can I, can I have my phone? It will go with you. All right. Can you guys please not do this? Do you this? mind searching her for me? Can you guys please awesome. Not do this? All right. She's not giving dangerous. She's not giving off dangerous. She is giving off young and spoiled, not understanding consequences of these things because now she's talking because she's in handcuffs. She's been chased down by a few police officers and now she is not ready to go to jail. She was not giving a damn in the beginning. She didn't care, but now look at what happened. And now she's ready to speak and say she didn't do this and that. Stop playing victim, girl. Going to jail. You're going to jail. Can you guys please sit down and sit back, sir? Sit back, sir. Sit back. I I can't. This is the thing. Why are you holding me like that? Holy shit! You guys gave me nowhere to freaking stop. It's not cool either. I'm not from here. I don't just stop in the middle of the road. The suspect was charged with multiple crimes, including possession of marijuana, which was discovered in her vehicle. She was given bond and eventually pleaded not guilty. That's what she gets. And pleading not guilty? What? You had it in your car, the, the Mary Jane. You know what I'm saying? Like, you went through a stop sign. Girl, you should have just pled guilty. The evidence was there. What are you talking about? 
How embarrassing to have your ex-boyfriend's mom have to tell you to get lost. Dang, girl, have some self-respect. Facts. It's hilarious how the son keeps opening the door and the mom keeps shutting it. I told y'all, like, what is wrong with him? Get him out of here. As a mother, I would be scared to death for my son. This girl is off in the head. Yes, she definitely is. The way she ignored those cops. Again, it could be because she's young and dumb. She hasn't experienced any consequences. And now maybe this is her first time of doing something. But it sounds like it wasn't. Who knows? But anyways, that's pretty much the video, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed this content. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know down below. And what are your thoughts? All right. Until next time, I'm China. I who party. I'm out.